As we're into the month of May and certainly the breeding season for spring calving herds, those herds here in Oklahoma that plan to use artificial insemination, I think we want to visit a little bit about the timing at which we actually do the uh, working of the cattle to do the insemination. You see, for years, we used to talk about an AM PM rule. In other words, if we saw the cow first in standing heat in the morning, we'd wait till the evening to breed her. Or if we saw her in standing heat for the first time in the evening, we'd wait till the following morning. That particular recipe works pretty well in areas north of here, up in the, the Minnesota, the Dakotas, and a lot of that particular data where that became a sound recommendation was done in dairy cattle in that part of the country. As we researched this further, over time, we found there wasn't a lot of difference in conception rates if we just did everything at one time a day. For instance, if we saw a cow in heat in the morning, we went ahead and bred her in the morning. If we saw her in heat in the evening, we waited until the following morning. Here in Oklahoma, in the kinds of warm temperatures that we can have in even May and certainly in June, I think there's a, another good reason to reconsider this and do all of our breeding in the morning hours if possible. You see, research was done here at Oklahoma State University and what they found was that cows out here on the range, not even being worked or gathered or messed with at all, the highest time of their body temperature occurred in the evening hours from about 6 p.m. to 11 p.m. And that would be a time typically when a lot of us might consider bringing those cows up and breeding them. But this data really, to me, suggests that we don't do that. You see, th these uh, cattle showed an increase in body temperature of well over one full degree. And uh, some of the data that has been done for years on dairy cattle has indicated that if we have that kind of an increase in body temperature at the time of insemination, we can have a loss in percentage conception rates of up to about 13%. So my recommendation is that if we're going to do AI on our cattle this spring, especially in some of those warmer days, let's make sure that we do our gathering and our AI in the morning hours. If you're going to plan a timed AI program, that's gonna mean some extra planning to make sure that the actual time that you're going to work the cattle through the chute is in the, the early morning hours, certainly try to be done by about 10 a.m before the uh, uh, actual outside temperature begins to warm up quite a bit and changes the body temperature of these cattle. I think you want to really take a hard look at breeding them in the morning. I think you have a little more success in your AI program this year. Hey, we look forward to visiting with you again next week on SunUp's Cow-Calf Corner.